All right, next uh, maneuver after we do the offset is going to be the straight line uh, back. Uh, the first step we're going to do here is get the truck back in gear, or obviously release our brakes. We're going to pull up to our Class A uh, boundary. Uh, what we want to make sure is that we have our steer tires sitting on top of that Class A boundary uh, to ensure that the truck and trailer are outside uh, the solid lines of this lane. So let's do that first. Just simply going to pull ahead. Once I get it in third gear, I can put both feet flat on the floor. We're going to simply just idle up there, idle speed. Kind of watching to make sure the equipment stays um, in between both lines. And make sure that my your tire sits on that boundary line. And at this point, now I'm going to go to reverse. Ease up off the clutch. Both feet flat on the floor at this point. And I'm simply going to allow the equipment to back up, which it'll do most of it for you. You're simply kind of watching. I would focus on uh, the left mirror, kind of watching this, the rail of the trailer, keeping the rail on that trailer straight with the line on the ground. Uh, if there's any kind of correction that needs to be made, I'm going to turn towards the problem by looking at the back of the trailer to tell me what's going on here. So if I have the trailer going to the left, I'm going to turn to the left, wait about five seconds, and then back center with the wheel back underneath the trailer. And vice versa, if the back of the trailer goes to the right, I turn the wheel to the right, half turn, I'd say, hold five seconds and then back center with your wheel. As you're seeing here, and with my wheel movement, there's not a lot of spinning of the wheel, turning of the wheel, just simply letting the equipment do most of the work for me. So once the back of the trailer comes outside the cone, it doesn't count anymore, and then you're just watching your tractor. And once the tractor passes behind your cone, then you're gonna go clutch and brake and stop, and then you're done with that maneuver.